engineering might be considered a traditionally male-dominated field. And with over 69% of Northwestern University's McCormick School of Engineering student body being male, it's not an unreasonable assumption to make. However, Northwestern's Baja, a club that builds cars to compete in off-road racing, challenged this norm by incorporating more women into these STEM-based fields. When I first joined the team, there was only one girl on a small team of seven people. But since then, we now have a team of 30 with six girls. So the team has grown a lot, including female membership. While the girls make up a small portion of the group, Baja member and Northwestern junior Sarah Gorlick thinks the input and ideas of the girls are invaluable. The girls bring a very different perspective in that um, we, we, yeah, we just think differently the way we were raised. So we'll, so we'll, we'll um, recognize something that could be an issue, something that um, could break or could fail in a, um, before like a guy does. For Northwestern sophomore Stephanie Gavell, having more girls is an asset that members of Baja definitely notice missing on other Baja teams. I think it's something that our team has that a lot of other Baja teams don't. We were just at a competition in um, the UP, and we were like maybe the only team with more than one girl. Gavell points to the welcoming community of Baja as one reason there's a growing number of female engineers within Baja. They're just very dedicated to having people who are excited about Baja and who um, really just want to help and learn. And it's kind of really cool to feel like you're building something, like you're putting in actual important work into building a car and you can see the finished product and that's something that's really fun. While members say this is an asset that makes Baja unique, Gavell also regards it as a unique feature for Northwestern. I think it's a feature of Northwestern in that uh, Northwestern students are um, just more willing to be involved. And, and Northwestern Engineering has a, has a large percentage of girls, um, a lot higher than, um, say, Michigan. With this rapid increase in female membership, girls in Baja, like Gorlick, are finding new ways to reach other female engineers on campus in hopes of expanding their group within Baja. We've always just tried to encourage girls to join. Uh, Faye and I have always been, like at activity fairs, we make sure to talk to them so they're not only talk to guys, they see there is a female presence on the team. And then we also just try to give them fun projects so they want to stay on the team. Sophomore Brooke Donnelly agrees, recognizing the importance of introducing and retaining new female members to the world of Baja. Once you get a girl on the team, it's sort of a catalyst to get more girls on the team. Girls might feel like that they don't belong in engineering, but like I completely feel like I belong here.